So now we're no longer getting fascinated by cops. <laughs> <laughs> Get investigated by the real shit now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, yo man, I didn't see that one coming. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't see that. I didn't see that one coming. It just came out of the blue. Eh? So, so you're, you're a young man. I'm, I'm thinking you sexual. You know, um, famous, yeah. making money. How how are the girls treating you at that time? No, it was last year, eh? <laughs> <laughs> I gotta say that. Podcast and chill. Matt G, the ghost lady, and Len Moleko. In the very many ladies and gentlemen, it is happening. Welcome to it. It's another episode of Podcast and Chill. And today I'm chilling with a freaking legend. Put some respect <laughs> on his name. Speech of Dog. Grand boy. Uh, no, no, man. Yes, it's been, last, it's been like how many years since I, I last saw you, bro? I saw. 10, 15? Oh. Yeah. It must be it must be much longer than that because I see you have a beard, both of us. I remember back in the day there was nothing like that. It was smooth. Uh, Yo, crazy days. Yo, dude, because I remember you and Byron and oh Monday, sir. Uh, you guys wanted me, you made me want to get on TV, bro. You seriously came after us? Yes. You're right, I'm a legend. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> I take myself for granted. I think I think I came out uh during the CC. Ah, yeah. Um you what's the white girl's with- name? Um, uh, Carly. Carly. Yeah. I was cipher after us. Yeah. yeah. But you guys were like the OGs, the originals. No, we're the real celebrities. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, I got. I be like, um, there was no, there was no way you could have us on your. Uh, you wouldn't have any of our pictures because we're not. We're not, we're not those points based in Yakoda. Yeah, so yeah. You understand? It's like mom to mom pet. You're like mom uncle. You funny camera now. Oh yeah. Mm. And and I remember when we started. I wasn't even speedway at the time because mm. there was something called the Rainbow Starship. I was Chaba. Uh, Chaba. Yeah, there was Chaba Blom and Entley at the time. That's when Byron and I started. Yeah, that's a long time ago. And it was. <laughs> I always tell the story. I couldn't speak English. You kidding? I'm I'm state third. Yeah, uh, I went from I went to Islam, like I went from the from a school in the hood. Yeah, and I remember when we had auditions and I was trying to something was smelling very funny and I was trying to say, <laughs> "Morning, it's just like we just and I'm like, "Guys, can you hear what's smelling?" Hey. <laughs> I'm telling you, everyone's like, "Yeah," I'm like, "No, but serious, can you hear what's smelling?" <laughs> People laughed at me, dog, for days. And I thought to myself, I'm not going to get into this TV thing. Yeah. If people can be so nasty. Because then people who started, then Bob and Bob will see, you know, you couldn't mm. just get on TV. But I think the fact that I could do a Suzulu and, and, and a bit of English uh, sort of helped me get, get the job. I remember I had to do 27 takes of Yo. super califragilisticexpialidocious. I'll never forget. Yeah. I'll never ever forget that. And who was uh, who were you auditioning with uh, your first YOTV um, interviews? Was Mandisa there? Uh, Byron? Mandisa and them. Byron, uh, I started with. Mandisa came after. Mandisa and Shade came after. Because mm. it was just the three of us. It was me, Byron, and Entley. But it was just taking too much of our schoolwork. Mm. And I remember when I mean, we, were, we were young, when... When Mandisa and uh, Shade came, they came with, <laughs> hey, <laughs> for young boys, sing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Was like, hey, Mandisa Shade, ah, they've thrown. But that's the thing, we used to always talk about your, your cup sizes. It <laughs> <laughs> was, was crazy. We were young, but me and Byron would look forward. Mm. Are you working with Shade today? Are you working with Mandisa today? Mm. Just because it was just so exciting to see girls with bigger Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. And then I think, dude, because after you, I feel like, a lot of Kasi guys then got a big break on TV. You know, I think after you like, whoa, what's this guy's name, man? Uh, Lungsta. Yeah. Lung, yeah, yeah. You know, because he had that Kasi flavor with you, you know? At first, I saw what happened at first is people wanted to, to speak English a certain way. Yeah. It was cool to speak like, yeah, bro, no, 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 no. I couldn't. It wasn't because Nzamuk Zenza are cool, but Bengu, Hey, man, girl, you know, you understand, you know, me, I, me, I love you, you know, but mm. it wasn't put on. It was like that. Yeah. So I want to come to how we got to our long star. So what happened was Byron's mom. Lungi Yeah, yes. Lungi yes. yes, those guys. So Byron's mom and the agent that I had, the sort of, uh, they would pick me up because I couldn't, t- I couldn't go to my traditional schools. Mm. So I was like, because I'm The apple I'm doesn't fall far from, from the tree. <laughs> 
of five kids counting <laughs> and counting. And who said I'm dead? <laughs> <laughs> no, so like I, they would pick me up on Fridays, good your phone, I'm like with the white people because black people would laugh at me. So I felt more comfortable na manga because they offered. Mm. So I remember this one time I'm at Byron's house and I'm 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 made to speak English because they speak English. Can shaw me on blind like uh, on my on my middle finger. And I'm like, yo, this pain is paining. <laughs> Byron's mom keeps following me. Excruciating. I was about to say, Seth, man. <laughs> like, I'm in, real, I'm in real pain. He's still trying to teach me. And I'm like, yo, this pain is paining. Excruciating. Excruciating. <laughs> you know when you're going to say, for <laughs> Do you know in, that, in this day and age, if there's social media back then, that would have been a meme, dude. That would have been trending. <laughs> wow. Okay. You know? <laughs> You know, like how all these things trend. Like, uh, you know, <laughs> what's the last thing that was trending? Some stupid shit that I don't doesn't follow. Make sense. That. I don't follow. I think I'm yeah, but you know what I mean. Uh, I know what you mean. But what I'm saying is, she helped me. See, I respect those people. They helped me a lot uh, to be this person that I am now. You know, I respect them so much. I mean, I miss Byron. Uh, by the time we figure out Monday, so like I say, we, we used to make fun of them at the time because we didn't understand better. Now we know how to treat women. They are our sisters. Are you still in contact with them? Oh, well, not really. I mean, Mandy's has got five kids as well in the UK. <laughs> it's a race. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's, ma- she's married with five kids. Uh, oh, Byron, where I'm born, yeah. uh, to be honest, because the last I had, he had a production company in the US. Yeah. So All right, cool. Listen, we'll get into your career shortly, but I want to find out, man. Let's get straight into the shits. What happened with Rhythm City, man? Uh, no, it was time. I'm um, Vanango Televara. That's one place I enjoyed working. Yeah. Okay, my best place in Spanigui was Jam Alley. Okay. Okay, fine. Let's yeah. put that out there. There'll never be a place like Jam Alley. I mean, yeah. I was young enough, crazy enough. The show, I had Vimesh, was crazy enough. I had Nestam. But second to Jam Alley, Rhythm City was home. Rhythm mm. City was dope. Rhythm City, I could, I, I, I took, I was, they gave me the, 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 the character Bash. Mm. And I could do anything with it. Mm. And for me to find Bash, I had to go to keep finding Pega Man Kele I'm like, no one kill a man. You know those people about the manga, but they get things happen. Yeah. And like the time I lay long sha sha. Mm. But eventually my I'm a cox was over toy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know his stories I lay in a lay my sala and I'm a cox was over toy. Yeah. So I had to find that bash in, 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 in one of my uncles and I played that character. I enjoyed that character and I, even if I say so myself, I played that character so So well. then why leave? It's ten years later. Mm. It's ten years later. Um so you think you outgrew the place? Yeah, yeah, but also it, it just felt like uh, it was the right time to go. Young to point, it's like not so slightly legini for so long. Man, just the right time to one. I'm between the room and a band. Like you get the room, the nala for a bazool. You know what I mean? Mm. It was. It, it's not that I couldn't do anything more ab- 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 about the character. It's just that the character has to grow, mm. and I don't know if people are ready for that growth. Mm. You know, una man kel like I say in fit, but I love so so so. But I didn't want to be the one that plays the same thing over and over because they end up being typecast as well. Yeah. But also, for me, I really think 10 years, it's been fun. I mean, but in, in, in every show I've done, I've stayed for long. I stayed seven years on your TV. I stayed six years on Generations. And I stayed 10 years here. I, I think that's how I, I maintain being in the game. Mm. It's just that, are we comedy game? Are we delay game? Marla delay. <laughs> <laughs> when you need to, yeah, when you need to, but yeah, uh, but yeah. you don't ever disrespect your craft. Yeah, no, you can't, hundred percent. And I really appreciate the Guspana now. We're grand, like being So you didn't get fired. It was a mi- amicable decision. No, no, why? It's grand. Mm. Like we left properly. That's why. It's spinning cars <laughs> at the Avalon. No, there was no, 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 no. I can't push the moon. It was really awesome. I'll tell you. Yeah, I'll tell you, especially on this show. I'll tell you. When when did you realize? Okay, shit, I gotta move out of here, man. It's been the past three years. When three we've, years? Yeah, it's been coming, man. It's been coming. There's a show that we're busy with with my wife uh, and our company called DZD. Beautiful wife, by the way. Oh, yeah. up again. Up again. <laughs> <laughs> Cup size. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, <I'm> kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no we'd, we'd, we had started uh, building on the show. We're uh, grooming the boys. We've got five boys. Yeah. So... They've been pushing this whole thing of hashtag men are trash. Okay. And my wife looks at me is like, mm. and it's like, you're already by trash. Like, mm. and already they've been told mm. that they're trash. So basically what they do is they, they, they want to grow up and be that. So we realize that they take, uh, they, they've got this thing of take a girl child to school. Okay. We're busy, we're busy uh, grooming the girls. 
but I will leave these boys and these boys now this this girls must come back to to the girls. And that's why I manage by Abulala na by Asha na manage that was a wazuk shela by a rapa because if you remember I don't know how you grew up. It's a malako like chere kutla tanda when you were like six, seven. Oh yeah, yeah, all the time. Oh, you are lucky. <laughs> I my dad was like after shade. Pa pa pa. Inda ba wuzo ni kwenye siku ni tan. So I knew you to turn up and bam, bam. <laughs> and that's a pressure. Yeah. But I mean, uncle is a grand. But I'm saying most kids don't grow up knowing good bang on, especially a machita. Mm. So our show is basically a, a, about seeing the life of the boys through our boys. Oh. But we'll go out there and we see, we'll find a guy, Ochuna Grand Escala. I got totally pissed off because he doesn't know where to go. Yeah. Go to a 14 year old guy who's a uh in a family we'll try and try to find someone to help uh, yeah. uh, through that. Um Tony we are juvenile we help them through but also we go to the black people uh, uh the, the young black people who are my age, your age, who mm. have made it mm. but come from those type of situations mm. where they're so well. Mm. So that we can all come back and adopt a brother, adopt a son, adopt I uh, adopt a friend so that we know how to talk to these to these brothers, these boys. Mm. So by the time we we, we 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 take them back to 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 Roman Thomas and I understand what's going on. Yeah, you're raising men. Yeah, you know what I mean. So mm. basically, now my wife is basically on the show. The 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 eyes of the women. Mm. We need to mama at the end of the day. Mm, mm. So why are we busy? Because once once we learn Thomas and you just kill someone's mom, someone's sister, someone's. Hey, dude. You understand? So we've been working on this for three years, but people are not. We're not seeing it like that because they're busy pushing. Hashtag man at trash. Hashtag man at trash. And that's not helping. Mm. That's us. Should we come and go and we out? But I want to do it. Mm. You know what I mean? Mm. And I, I mean, I like the initiative which now and I know to show what we can do the right things by being men. This is this is dope. Yeah. You're pushing it without some white guy pushing you. Over, uh, 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 is. Yeah, like but white guys are welcome if they have money. You know? <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> I'm not saying we're not welcome. I mean, money is money, but I'm just saying we're open for business. <laughs> you know, you know, they used to think that I'm a rapist until this guy was a trust or a pum done. And now they're saying what? Hi, I'm a drugs or I get normal. Maramagutak is like, ah, what do you expect? You understand? You need to change that mentality. How was your uh, relationship with your dad? Because I remember. Uh, in as much <coughs> as you got the OTV gig young, you were also a breadwinner at home. Yeah, yeah, still am. The <laughs> 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 motherfuckers don't want to work. <laughs> like our brothers that are chilling. My brothers are like, I'm going to go no, it was dope. Uh, it was Tamala Mumfuni. Tamala is very Zulu. So at first, man, Karu Gwenza and Nama TV is like, I'm not going to go to the TV. I'm going to go to the TV. I'm going to go to the TV. Money started coming in. That's like, yeah. Seven Zaga Manja. I'm going to go to the TV. And then there's a time when I was like, we're singing Spanish and Funuva after the Kuli Serang and the Lazin. Second, I'm going to go to the TV. So I'm at parents' place on weekends. I'm at my place uh, during the week. Ah, and then I'm parents by my chica. Parents like, no, dad, go away. I don't want to talk to you right now. <laughs> Closes the door. I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm doing that at home. <laughs> <laughs> I'm definitely going to do that at home. I'm finding a place. I'm, and I've got this thing with Lomnyang with Fawai. Yeah, <laughs> you <know>? okay. <laughs> so I'm like, I have a bang phone with now. Bah! It's like, yeah. Oh, I'm trying to stop, I want, eh, I mean, kick the door down. <laughs> <laughs> no, mind you, the boys' room doesn't have a door. <laughs> oh, God. No, it was, it was, it was rough, you, but he tried to show me that it's your money, but it's my house. Yeah. And I think it's one of those things that have helped you know, me too. Uh, people don't understand that it's so tough being a child star because in your journey, in as much as it's in the public eye, yeah. you don't know what the fuck you're doing. No. You have to learn... As you go. True. You understand what True. I'm saying? Because there's no one to sit you down and say, okay, cool. This is how you handle this. This is how you do this. Media, boom, boom, boom. You learn on the road, bruh. And then before you know it, you're 30 years old. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and you're still learning. And you're still learning. And, and, and you still have these motherfuckers who look at you like, I'm out of the You could have And you're like, I'm, I'm, I'm 38. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It's true though. People don't understand. You don't, it's like, you used to good record. You used to record. Now, so... So, Pama Pizza, and also Razukshama, 
I'm a 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 I'm Mm. Like whether I'm sick or I'm or in group, I'm just supposed to. So you've got the media who perceives you this way. Yeah. You've got your dad who perceives you this way, and you're trying to find yourself as a young person, a young person in this world. In this world, and I'm not even sure what it is, but I'm going to be stoked, cool. What's to be stoked, cool? What the hell? Ah, my speech is when we're stoked. Speech? No, 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 no. <laughs> hey, speech is the original, the OG of stoutness. <laughs> It's the conception. I want that one. I or misconception. You know what I'm talking about? I'm talking about. Well, I was. I was a bit. But the uh, shit, shit was crazy in general, dog. Let's no, be honest. There was. There was time. There was. I mean, in, there's a time in your life. That's why they say, you know, done everything you do in stages. Mm. Jamel was crazy, dude. I can imagine. And I don't think people understand. Like, okay, right now. Celebrities are so accessible, you know? Yeah. So to be a celebrity right now, it's not the same as 10 years ago. No. Like when you're a celebrity 10 years ago, you were a celebrity. No, I don't know. It's not so good as well. It was good as night. It was proper. Yeah. Now it's like, oh, no, no, no. Um, I've got a selfie with him, whatever, whatever. Yeah. Donna then it was like, yeah. And, then, oh, and people would stop. Yeah. You know, people wouldn't invite you to their weddings because they know you find your takeover. Yeah. But, um, Explain how big Jamelly was. Jamelly was too. Much. Was you him? tell me how you used to run oh, at half past six. You were getting Jamelly, dog. Uh, that's what I'm saying. People don't understand. Like for you, I don't know who is equivalent to you being on Jamelly then now. Like in terms of fame wise. Wow. I don't know. I am humble now. I'm not I don't to know. You know no. <laughs> now no, I'm not to say. There's certain shows that just yeah. catapult your career or your status to another stratosphere that you cannot explain. It did. And you know what's funny about how I got that job even was uh, after Nimrod, they were looking to replace Nimrod. They had Joop Joop. Uh, they had... Okay, Root Boy stayed a bit longer. That bed boy tea, I'm shy, I'm busy, I? Hey, 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 Thomas. <laughs> uh, they had uh, um, this boy from Rotunda. Oh, pause. Hey, pause, I'm born to myself, I'm sorry. <laughs> I was supposed to do one, like, okay, we all had, I'm going to do four shows a day. Yeah. So you're supposed to do, as a guest presenter, you do one. Mm. I did the first <clears> one, then I'm like, came down, I was like, um, do you have more rhymes? Can you do another one? I'm like, yeah. I mean, uh, you came to the right place. Mm. I enjoyed that show. And what I liked about it was you wrote your own script. Oh, okay. Sir. Yeah, so whatever you open with, it's the stuff that you write. Yeah. Uh, they probably would write the questions for you now and then. But once you get used to the show, then you, 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 you ask your own questions. But it was so much fun. That Monge and Nanjay SAPC already overnight live off of me. Before you see the audience. Mm. Then they say to you, go to the audience, teach them what you want them to say. Yo, mm. Mm. I remember... If 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 seven if there was this trending thing, seventy babes would have been the most trending thing in the world because that thing was big. That seventy babes, mm. yo Shamata fool, yo I love the show, bro. Yeah. That was that was awesome. Yeah, it felt like it wouldn't end, but I think they messed it up. That's why it didn't end so well. Uh, how old were you when you when you did Jamelli? Sure, I was at a time where I was too young for your TV. I was too old for your TV, but too young for everything else. <laughs> twenty twenty one. Twenty twenty one. Yeah. Okay, so now we're no longer getting fascinated by cups. <laughs> <laughs> getting fascinated by the real shit now. <laughs> oh man, yo man, I didn't see that one coming. <laughs> I didn't see that. I didn't see that one coming. It just came out of the blue. Eh? So, so you're, you're a young man. I'm, I'm thinking you're sexual. You know, um, you're famous, yeah. making money. How how are the girls treating you at that time? No, it was Lachelle, eh? <laughs> <laughs> I gotta say that. Uh, my, my wife, this is way before your time. <laughs> and you know this. <laughs> yeah. No, it was Lachelle. It was, uh, I think it was too easy. Yeah. Uh, with girls galore, man. Dude. Especially for Miss Jem Ailey. Mm. Uh, but my my thing was, Never promised something I want to do to some father Miss Jamie. That, mm. that I, I couldn't do. But there were just those who would be like, just just look more on you now, you know? It was and, like and, a blue and, tick. Yeah, uh, 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 Joe. <laughs> and I remember we used to have. Um, <coughs> oh. Yeah, I'm finding keep it says in New Zealand. 
<laughs> it was uh, some group back in the day called <laughs> Infinity Players. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Rick T. Rick T, my wife is here. Huh? Couldn't, couldn't we shoot this thing somewhere else? No, man. She doesn't mind. <laughs> it was, uh, I mean, those guys didn't, we had something called a black book where you wouldn't be seen with the same girl twice. Mm. Yeah, like, yeah. And Wait, also, how, does, how does that work? No, like, once we are this time, it's over. Like, that's it. And then, oh, yeah, it's good to you. And who was part of the black book? I mean, who was part of the players club, whatever it's called? Um, yo. It was you, Nimrod, Bad Boy T. Chup, chup. Nana, <laughs> you're still my manager. You can stop me at any time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All I can say was all the bad boys were a part of that. Wow. Uh, our kingdom. Mm. Which was in them. Uh, Would you ever, like, smash one of the contestants? No, mm. no, 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 no. That's what I'm saying. That's where we drew the line. Mm. Um, between um sevenzi, um sevenzi. That's why I think sometimes now people don't respect their craft. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see? Yeah. You need to understand that this person is a contestant. This person needs this TV that they're going to win. They need this mm. jam chocolate. Mm. They need this, this money, this little money they're going to get. Mm. You cannot mess with that. That's where people get it wrong. It's fine, people who are having fun, but I mean, the age, it was the right age to do that. Yeah. But don't bring that to work. How many girls would you smash in a week? At your heyday, prime time, Jam early, speech, Jam blaster next to you. I don't recall. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm smarting you on that one. <laughs> but did you, did you ever get in love during that time? Yeah. But how, how would you tell this is a groupie, this is someone who really digs me? You couldn't tell because you weren't looking for love. Mm. You know what I mean? It was, it was also a, a boy's thing at the time, which is cut so glad. When I eventually did fall in love, I got hurt badly. Is it? Yeah. By, by who? Is she famous? Yeah. <laughs> you lie. Monday, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Mandy's already messed me up with the titties a long time ago. <laughs> <laughs> As a grown man now. <laughs> Who was it, dog? Aye. Nanang Bajel. No. Vinoli. Take a sip if I'm right, dog. <laughs> She's still famous right now. Yeah, she's on something. I just saw on TV now. Is it Gianni or something? Ah, mm. please tell us. You should actually get uh, Vinola on, on, on the show. Yeah, I'd love to. Yeah. I don't know how to contact her, man. Actually, I'd love to. I'm going to try and help you get her. Please, she's still man. Crazy. You know, that woman was crazy and she's, she's, a, she's a fantastic person. Tell me crazy Vimesh story. I, 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 I like being a legend, dog. I don't want to be a snitch. <laughs> I like the word legend behind my name. I don't want snitch behind my name. Can I just not? For real. Just, there is, like the stories. There's a lot of stories. I said, I'm done. I'm going to respect that. She'll tell you, though. Yeah. What I'll do is I'll promise to help you get her okay. on the show. Okay. Mara, when she walked in, because I never went to actually Jamelli's studio, funny enough. Yeah. But when she walked in, she had that aura. Mfana <laughs> And I remember back then she was the t- uh, she had just got a big sponsor, a Tata Electrowise, what what. So she was she was it. Mm. Now there was this confusing thing because she was in generations at the time looking good and as Bambi and then Mambo and you know, as a young man, I couldn't um, I gotta say, I'm I'm sorry, Nana. There was a time where I thought of her mm. in a different way, like you know, if she could say Tata, I wouldn't say no. <laughs> <laughs> you know she was V mash. Yeah. If she wanted to mash on me, I'd be like, yeah. I'll be the V on the mash. <laughs> 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 now we know why you're five years, my nigga. <laughs> 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 now we know why you're five years. Are there are there any other famous chicks that um, you're with that you can disclose? <coughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. 
Man har inte så mycket. Vad ska jag göra? Oh, I mean, I mean, I mean, you gotta own that shit, dog. You gotta own that shit. You are the shit, my nigga. I think you don't understand. People gotta know. This guy, na na. I'm running in there. Young far, right there. All I can say, I'm actually gonna say it. Yeah. Shorter. Okay, I don't know your wife. We are handling them, so as you can see, I gave you a good wife after me. Pumeza, a short as wife. Oh, yeah, yeah Pumeza. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, yeah, she's a man. flame. So, yeah, she's, a, she's good people. I'm just saying, short, I don't... Just know I left you something. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't take it all. <laughs> <laughs> One love still, though, yeah. <laughs> hey. Hey, yeah. What's that song? Number, <laughs> number PM, number Bluetooth. What's that short <laughs> song? What? Thank cartel. Oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> so, hey, man. Anyway. Ah, my link for the HIV. No, no. I'm here. I'm going to talk about HIV. So, I know what it is. Let's go to generations now. Yeah. How how different is it from um, Jam Mali? Because that's also huge, man. That's a big yeah, platform. Generations was exactly that. It was different. And the fact that I had to act someone so different from me was awesome. I mean, I, I acted a very... A guy was a, a very serious guy. I mean, Nusa Mani was was a guy who would not even be on your show. <laughs> was there a black book in generations? Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I I say I'd, I'd outgrown a lot of stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but also, I'd seen a lot of people. I would see once you're at the fake top, there's a lot of fake people. Hey, hey boss, they're everywhere. Boss, boss. They're everywhere. <laughs> I used to roll with an entourage, it, my nigga. There were people who were lying to my face. Yeah, I remember uh, uh, I played rugby with your Jeppy boys. Yeah. I never went to any multiracial <laughs> school. I never played rugby. And I'm, I had to look at this guy. I'm like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, you know what I mean? People. Yeah. And there's a lot of. And man, you're a And man, you And you have one good okay. You're the man. You're like, man, put it out. You know, like, <laughs> what's going to happen? Let me just let him be. Mm. So there was a lot of fakeness. That uh, when I got on two generations, I mean, I was also I started, I started hanging, I started doing music now with my cash. Mm, mm. Um, so there was a thing of, I'm not just a celebrity now, I'm elevated because you know, like when we're gonna scheme some celebrity, I will ban 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 I will ban ban ada, and then I was hanging with the Mendozas, the, mm-hmm. the the my cashes, the real crews. What were you guys talking about at that time, bro? I'm more crazy about music, eh? Uh, we're crazy about music and especially putting a stamp. We wanted Kwaito to be the hip hop because mm. Kwaito had taken over, but people don't know where to put it. What didn't it drive you crazy? Like, now you chilling with Mendoza, dog. Yeah, you got him on WhatsApp. Oh, there was no, <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, no what's up, then? <laughs> I wonder what it would have been like now. With <laughs> I remember what uh, the guys used to do sometimes because I need to know, like, I'm a musician, like, was a whole lot, like from Thursday, fr- fr- Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, they got gigs. Yeah, yeah. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and I'm going to go for the But I'm going to go for the SAPC, but for lunch. Because we used to get free food. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so it was just that type of, a type of thing that also got out of, out, of, out, of, out, of, out of line at some point. How? What do you uh, mean? No, man. We. It's just a poor mental thing, man. Mm. We started drinking too much. We thought we were bigger than the game. And that's when... And you know what's crazy? At that time, you think it's not going to end this thing. Bunny, I think that's where you think, I'm me, that's <laughs> it. You don't see anything else. It's just me and the highway. <laughs> yeah. And I think that's when, that's when I took my first big bump, you know? Mm. Um, generations, I'll tell you straight. Uh, generations, I was fired, dog. Mm. <laughs> I was fired. And because I was young enough, and um, um, after that, I'd, I'd lost a lot of things. You lost. to move back home. Shit. Much it don't come, but now I'm a man in love. I'm a man in love. I'm a man in love. You know, it was rough. Um, Were you embarrassed at that time? Hell yeah. Yeah. Uh, now I'm there and there's no bread. Mm. Uh, how, how the fuck do you feel? Yeah. But my parents, were, I mean, they were supportive and, and they tried. And all those friends, gone. Ndana kalawo. Yeah, man, yang langa pa, and lemfeta uvul. 
No, no, no. Oh, it's over. I'm not going to say anything. I'm not going to say anything. Oh, I'm not going to I swear, true story. A lot of them. Because now they're thinking I'm <laughs> they're, they're outside my gate. But it uh, was rough. Yeah. And the worst thing is I lived on and the hill in North Cliff. So it was like people just wanted to be there. Wow. So it was nice. And this is the first time since your TV where you are not speech. Yeah. It's the, actually, it's the first time ever. Yeah, you're right. Ever since I got on, I, I, like I'm known, but I don't want to be known. Mm. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm mm. like, I'm praying for someone to not see me mm. when you're in a big scene. Mm. And your parents were very receptive. They ah, understood. Joke, you see, the best thing I did for myself was when I got on TV, I carried on what I was doing every month, even when I left home. Every month, man, call like me Okay. So it was that thing of, a kind of young born every mm. time. Mm. Yeah, my mother mm. didn't want to go to Mali, wherever. Like, she wanted you to come. I tried to cut as in there. Like, niggas cut like when she feels like it. Mm. <laughs> Which was good. So when I when I went back home, it was like I boy, I'm done. I'm Yeah, you know, I was never too big for my parents or my brothers. Andrews. I think that's the best thing I did for myself. You lost the car. The ah, car first thing to go. <laughs> <laughs> Couple of savings. I still stayed. My mother knew that it was rough because I still stayed in North Cliff. Gave me a call one time. With, What's the car? I got it. And then the I love by Seiko. And she's like, the more bang, the more bang born, I would get better. But clear. But if they don't see you, mm. then they won't know whether you're doing well or what. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The worst time of my life turned out to be the best time of my yeah. life. Yeah, isn't it weird? Yeah, in hindsight, it, right? Because <coughs> that's when I was at my lowest, and that's when I met my beautiful wife. Wow, an angel who was gonna take me the way I was. She met you when you had no job. Yeah, no job. keep keep. In fact, yeah, I'm telling for she truly. It's okay. 